WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, good afternoon update for TFNN, mid-afternoon. Uh, we've got the Fed coming out here at uh, 2 o'clock, and it'll be Mr. Powell himself speaking. What I've done here, folks, I posted the uh, chart of the E-mini S&P over the last five days here, and I've had a system that I've been using since they started trading that thing back in April, of uh, April 16th of uh, 1982. There's 13 steps that you need to really look at this closely, and I posted this ahead of time. So that first target up there at 14, excuse me, 44, uh, 16 was po 44, 17 was posted first, and then later today when we had the three higher bottoms, as you can see there, that means that the the market could get all the way up to that four, uh, 426 uh, level, 4,026 level, with uh, Mr. Powell speaking. Of course, any move now below the secondary point there at. Uh, 30, uh, 4, 43.89 would say that this market has made some type of a small ABCD top up here, but it's still a little bit early in the day, especially with the Fed out there, and it usually gets very, very active, and that's uh, the key to look at. These actually, these principles could be used for just about anything, but they were made for the S&P. I was at the Merck, and they asked me to teach some of the young traders coming up, and uh, so these were some of the things that I focused on, you know, with the little rudimentary tools that I had back then. And days the same ones I got today, folks, and I haven't changed them at all. You know why? They still work. The good part is they don't work all the time, because if they worked all the time, everybody would see this, but they work most of the time. The $64,000 question that's everybody asking me today has gold made a bottom? We had an order to buy it today at 1945. We got down to 1948. We've rallied $26, folks, off the bottom. And I have to say that we have to wait. Uh, there's still a possibility to get down there. Gold is very tricky. And that number is really, really big. Now, $3 is very, very close. I've kicked myself today. Why didn't I buy it at 52, 54, 56, or 60. I was waiting for a 382 retracement that never came. And so I sat here with this little uh, beautiful white uh, wedding dove flying away with the profits that I could have made. Let's take a break. We're going to be right back. Rich Anderson is our guest today, 877-927-6648. 